sitting here watching the news, it has become more of a reality that we do unfortunately have to cancel our honeymoon to Italy and Greece because of this virus going around. It's such a scary time to live in and I did already call the cruise line to try and cancel on my own but unfortunately they were giving me a little bit of a hard time. Um, I'll call back in a week or so but I understand they want to keep their money so they're trying to go as close as they can to the sailing date or I guess that little bit of chance that it will still be on but I doubt it. it's just about a month away now we were supposed to fly from New York City to Rome and stay a night in Rome until our cruise ship sails off to Naples and that would be so scary for me. I don't want to go. But Devin and I will pl probably plan something small still. Um, maybe here in the United States and still make it special for us. Hopefully this virus goes away soon um, as the warmer weather is coming. Um, who knows? But we're just praying for the best and... Everybody stay safe and use all the precautions you can throughout your day. I went to ShopRite and Costco yesterday and I guess other many other people just like me are panicking a little bit and getting all the food and um, paper goods that we can so that the shelves were pretty much empty out of any um, canned foods and any paper goods. But I don't think that the food stores will close totally. But us as human beings just get a little nervous inside. So we want to protect ourselves. So now that I am on Weight Watchers, I have been researching um, recipes that I can incorporate some sweets. But still keeping my daily points low. So I found this banana bread recipe that looks really amazing in the app. And whether some of you are on Weight Watchers or not, you could still bake this. I've been trying to get into the habit of using what I have in the refrigerator and the pantry before going out to the store and getting something. So um, I only have white whole wheat flour here so that's what I'm going to use. It calls for um, all purpose regular flour and wheat flour but I'm just going to use the one that I have. It's baked with walnuts, but you could take that out. I am going to be baking it with walnuts because I love that crunchy feel and taste in my mouth. But um, you don't have to use them. It also calls for fat-free milk, but you can substitute that for, I would say, almond milk um, or regular milk, whatever you prefer. The first thing I'm going to do is set the oven to 350. I have this masher that's usually just used for potatoes, but um, this works too with bananas, I guess. Um, you can also and push down on the banana. It's easier when the banana is very ripe because it gets mushy quick. Now I'm gonna mix together the flour, baking powder, and salt in a large bowl. I don't wanna get too dirty because later this afternoon we're meeting one of my best friends at Larita Winery for her surprise engagement. She's been waiting for this day for a long time. They've been together for a while now, so I'm so happy for her and so excited that this day has finally come for her. Now I'm putting two teaspoons of baking powder and one teaspoon of baking soda. And finally, a half a teaspoon of salt.
Before you mix the butter, it's supposed to be at room temperature, but mine was in the refrigerator, so I'm just going to put it in the microwave for about 10 seconds until it gets a little softened. I have been trying to drink a lot of water as it does help immensely with your with your weight loss. I've been doing okay so far. I probably need to drink more, but um, so far I've been drinking about six of these water bottles per day. Now I'm gonna mix the sugar and the butter together. If you don't have brown sugar, I'm sure you can use regular sugar. It might just change the points a little bit. While this is cooking in the oven, I'm going to go get dressed for this big day that's to come. I'm so excited to give her the gift that I made her. I'll show you in the car what I did. It's been a little less than an hour. It looks really delicious and I think it should be ready now. I'll I'm going to let it cool in the refrigerator for a little bit until we get back. Hello to all the nerds out there. Keep it gangster. That's all I have to say for now. I got this cute box at Home Goods. Oh, yeah. It fits perfectly inside. So I, I made this for her. I bought the jacket at Old Navy and the writing off of Etsy and ironed it on there. And this gold heart is from Joanne Fabrics and I wrote this on here with um, fabric paint. Me cousin Pat used to dance too. It's nice out. Let's go for a walk. I'll get up. Oh, stop it. Isn't this a beautiful view? Look at all these, um, these grapes. Huh? Look at all these grapes. <laughs> Look at all the grapes. America. And your mom. It is nice in the sun. <laughs> 